I feel like the federal government is just going to totally collapse these next few years. And it's reflected in candidates who do not represent any clear vision. Donald Trump is a fucking Zionist shill and a fat fuck. Biden, really shitty, but like nobody wants either of these douchebags in office. And anybody who does is just obviously low IQ. The overturning of Roe v. Wade is like the only thing that Biden is running on. The very thing that he helped destroy, Democrats still think he's the savior. You could not be this retarded if you were huffing paint for a living. I think state politics are going to take a larger role, state and local politics, which actually means that people are going to get involved in the process a lot more, which is good. I'm a big fan of ranked choice voting. In states like Maine, we already have it, but we should have it in every fucking state. We should have a conversation about healthcare, which Uniparty does not want us to have under any circumstances. Talk about defunding Israel and defunding all these fucking faggot wars. Infrastructure, that's my bread and butter, infrastructure. And there's so many fucking issues that we don't even fucking talk about because we're more concerned with the personalities. It's like, oh, Biden was showered with his daughter. Trump is like, he's selling sneakers. Bitch, who gives a fuck? You're a fucking hack. Suck my dick. I'm not gonna vote for a fucking pedophile, but even though he's a pedophile, guess what? Trump also probably a pedophile, but the difference is I haven't had Fucking Biden hammered into my fucking head every two minutes in the media. Keep not voting, because most Americans don't vote. They don't vote. Keep not voting. And keep working on yourselves and keep working on improving your family, because that's where your strength is going to be against the state.